repeat, toxology alert. Danger of rapid neural decay. Local flora chemically incompatible with human physiology. From the look of it, this beacon's been here a while. Why would they wait years to signal? Pause in beacon protocol. Eight years, 237 days, seven hours. Pause is recorded as record deleted by acting captain Ronald Taylor. That's not right. My father was first officer. Ronald Taylor was promoted under emergency command protocols. Other flagged issues, unsafe deceleration, local food and neural decay, beacon activation protocols. I assume unsafe deceleration refers to the crash. Give me the details. Following an unspecified impact and sublight drive failure, the Hugo Gernsback made an unscheduled descent at 465% of theoretical recommended suborbital velocity. The Hugo Gernsback then decelerated at 782% of theoretical recommended approach velocity, sustaining significant damage to investment and crew. Why are you comparing the crash to theoretical speeds? The Hugo Gernsback was constructed off-world. It is not rated for suborbital descent, and doing so exceeded operational parameters. Who is in command of this ship? Where are the survivors? Captain Harris Fairchild reported killed following unscheduled suborbital descent. First Officer Ronald Taylor promoted infield to acting captain. But where is he now? The location of the remaining crew of the Hugo Gernsback is unknown. This beacon has been unattended for several maintenance cycles. Local food impairs brain functions? What are the effects? Impairment of mental function due to chemical imbalance begins within seven days of ingesting local flora, regardless of decontamination or preparation. Impact on higher cognitive abilities and long-term memory is cumulative, but significant within a standard month. It is not known if neural decay is permanent. Data collection was not completed. Why wasn't the beacon activated before now? This emergency beacon became functional after 358 days, 12 hours, following the unscheduled suborbital descent of the Hugo Gernsback. Activation was triggered remotely after 8 years, 237 days, 7 hours, on the authority of Acting Captain Ronald Taylor. Pause in beacon protocol is recorded as... Record deleted. Yeah, so... That's a long-ass time. Come on, let's get going. My father had a working beacon, but didn't signal for almost nine years. Maybe that neural decay affected him. It must have, after so long. Some have lost faith. The Hunters. They will have seen your star. They will not let you help him. What are you talking about? You're not making sense. Uh, I... I don't remember how to say it. He's our leader and we serve so we can go home. But some want to fight him. They were... they were cast out. He exiled them. So they hunt his machines and those who help him. They don't believe that rescue will- Watch out! Hunters, they won't stop until the leader is dead. Kill them! Agents of the liar! He will not escape! They've seen us. Okay, psycho. Oh. Ah. Ah. Mm. 
like I said, this Lord of the Flies type of shit up in here. The folks at Bio Bioware must read a lot. Because they're crazy. Is that a settlement? They better be friendlier than the beach group. I need answers. <laughs> oh god. Your face! <laughs> the evil face! Huh. They're from the same group as the ones that attacked us, but these are docile. There aren't any men here. Maybe it affects genders differently. It makes males get violent. Possibly, but the female on the beach said the exiled ones came back as hunters. It doesn't matter right now. One of these people must know what my father has to do with this. You have his face. <laughs> he promised to call the sky, but he sends nothing. He forced us to eat. To decay. You are cursed with his face. <laughs> the best reaction to the family resemblance, Jacob. <laughs> Why would my father force his crew to eat toxic food? Whatever's happening here needs to stop. They've been eating only that toxic local food for who knows how long. Like that wasn't obvious enough. He has a cruel face. His cruel face. Damn. Go away. You are like him. You will keep us here. I can't talk to you. I don't want punishing. Punishing is in like forced sex. The hunters will kill you. They fight because he exiled them and waited too long. He keeps us, protects us, and we please him like he demands. Ew, harem. He is bad. He has a bad face like the other, like him. You'll hurt me. What the hell? Somebody had to push them to make that. That's borderline worship. his machines you might stop this this I forget how to read but this was the start what he promised and what they did to us we need the sky take us back to the sky Jacob what does it say it's a crew log book some of them thought the beacon repair was taking too long they were afraid they'd run out of supplies and lose their minds to the decay my father restricted the ship food for himself and the other officers so they wouldn't be affected. Everybody else had to eat the toxic food and hope for treatment later. The rest is a casualty list. A few mutinied over the decision. My father and his officers turned the mechs on them. Damn! He wasn't command material and it got to him. Couldn't keep the crew in line without violence. It didn't stop there. More incidents, harsh punishments. It's like they're cattle. Or toys. In a year. All the male crew members are flagged as exiled or dead. They separated out the women, assigned them to officers, like pets. Oh. After the beacon is fixed, the officers appear in the casualties too. After. My father took control and didn't stop it. Anything in there about whether the effects of the toxic food can be treated? 